He got him! Hey, good morning, allies. It is uh, almost two in the morning, and uh, I finished my video a while ago, and I was just about ready to go to sleep, and I looked out this window, and right, right here, ah, I noticed uh, a praying mantis. We we get praying mantis so rarely. I, I I've only seen them like twice, and it's on my front door. And the first time was on my old front door before they remodeled it. Now this is the second door. And so Leia said, go get him, and there he is. Um, so we put him under a little, this is one of little uh, Leia's salad containers, until I can get a better a better one for him. He's hanging out. I'm gonna try and, uh, I'm gonna try and incapacitate some flies with the salt gun and, and plop them in there. And barring that, I'm gonna grab some crickets or some meal, probably some mealworms tomorrow. Um, at the uh, at the old pet shoppy and uh, feed him up because I, I don't know what's I'm gonna look it up and figure out what species he is he looks healthy he or she I don't know I'm assuming it's a she yeah, it's probably a she because the larger ones are are she's from what I understand you don't see the he's very often because they get their heads cut off yeah so happy morning happy 2 a.m. Good morning, allies. I know you were all very concerned. I lost these glasses for a while. Uh, we found them, you know. I, I was getting handwritten letters at home, people saying how much they like these glasses and I need to find them so I can wear them on the vlog again. So rest assured, your, your, your wishes and your prayers have been answered. In other news, a couple little updates. So last night at like one o'clock when I, when I finally finished editing and, and cleaning and everything, uh, I found a mantis on the front door. I don't know the species exactly. And um, I sent a picture of it to Leia. She was in bed trying to get Edison to go to sleep. And she was like, oh my God, catch it. So I, I put it in a, in a little container and, and I'm gonna go get it a terrarium, I guess, later today. I gotta figure out how much they eat because some mantis they eat every day and others only eat a couple of times a week. Uh, I don't know the species yet, so I'll have to figure it out. If any of you know, here's a picture. You can, uh, you can tell me what it is in the, in the comments below. Now, regarding yesterday's video on Gary Johnson, I'm sure I'm gonna get a ton of comments, but I've already gotten one and I think I need to address it. There is a lot of misinformation about Gary Johnson's stance on things. And there it's and I think it's because people go to their their trusted news sources, and those trusted news sources are just taking snippets of actual discussion that Johnson had. And so his words are getting twisted because he's not making Trump positional points or Clinton positional points. He's making highly nuanced discussions on what it is to be free and what it is to deregulate and what it is to cut back on taxes. So you owe it to yourself. You don't even owe it to him. You just owe it to yourself to like go back and maybe try and comprehend things differently because he's not saying that he's supporting these things. He's saying that he's saying that we should be free enough to 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 not choose that by letting the the, the system the market handle it now regarding bill weld uh, second amendment he's come out and said he was wrong uh he's changed his mind so if we say that trump is not anti-gun then we kind of have to take this guy on his word as well that he's saying he's not anti-gun or pro-gun control either so understand we we really need to go to the horse's mouth and get the get the quotes from the people directly guys Sometimes, you know, sometimes you make a video and you've got these, you have these thoughts in your head, you've got these big heavy thoughts and you want to, you want to let them out, but you only have big heavy words to explain it. And then you go to sleep and then you wake up in the morning and you realize that there was a much easier way to express your thoughts and you, you didn't have the words for it or you were so in the moment, this big heady thought, so you had your, you're wrapping your mind around these, these chunky, chewy words and really all it comes down to is, we should let Johnson in the debate because he's not an authoritarian. And Clinton and Trump are authoritarians, period. They don't have the same platform, but they are authoritarians. Johnson is not. And by having him in the debate, you're challenging the authority. And that's what we want. That's what we need. That's what we don't have enough of. 
I just summed up the whole video in less than a minute. <laughs> oh boy. One, two, the waves are four meters. Last night, the shit's overrated. Well done, the hype just faded. This tornado had to be reinstated. Bang, bang, the bomb, the bomb. Good evening, allies, and another long day today. But now we're gonna stop and get a little equipment, a little gear for our Mantis buddy at home. Set him up in a terrarium, get him fed. Should be fun. I gotta bring my metal detector over here. Ooh, what's going on? Okay, so small little terrarium. Got a couple of crickets and some stuff to put on the bottom. Pretty cheap. We'll throw some crickets in there and see if we can get them to eat. Okay, are we unboxing this, Ben? What is this? Is this Japanese action warrior man? Yeah. Okay. That doesn't sound bad. Okay, come here. No, 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 no. It goes in the front. Yeah. Is that cool? Yeah. We're gonna give the mantis a new home. Yeah. You got a bigger house. This is coconut husk, compressed coconut husk. I'm just gonna leave it like that and let it get wet. We got some mantis dirt here. So now I need some twigs and other stuff. Let me go get that. One, two, the waves are four meters. Last night the shit so parade. Well done, the hype just faded. Yay! Okay, here we go. Successful mantis transfer. Bang bang the ball. Bang bang the ball the big. Got him! Yeah, buddy! Yeah, buddy! That was crazy! That was pretty impressive. That was the first time I've ever seen a mantis like live take like a prey like that. I've uh, I've seen like videos of mantis doing that. Um, but that was pretty cool, so I'm, I'm okay now, because it's such, he's such a small little skinny dude, I didn't think he'd be able to like, I thought I got crickets that were too big, but he popped it, he popped it right into his mouth, that's pretty cool. Um, they live about six months or so, is what I was told, and they can get kind of big, depending on the species. This guy, I, I, I think it's an Asian or Chinese mantis, I'm not positive, but um... Seems pretty cool. He's probably gonna get a lot bigger. Particularly for how much crickets I buy, he better get a lot bigger. <laughs> so I think something that would be kind of fun is uh, I'm gonna try and hook my GoPro up to my laptop or my uh, my computer, and I'm gonna try and live stream the the tank uh, during the day when I'm at work. I've got to figure out how to do it though, because I don't think that just natively is a source, an output source, so I gotta figure out how to do that. Everything else would be easy, I just have to figure out how to make that be a video camera, if you will. So, question of the day, what should I name the, the new Mantis pet? Leave your comments below, I would appreciate it. Thank you. So that will do it for today. Kind of weird having an insect for a pet. I never really thought I'd have an insect for a pet in my life. So that's, that's odd. <laughs> uh, if you enjoyed this, leave your comment below, give me a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you. For tomorrow, I actually do now have to clean up my office. Uh, everything got sidetracked with 
with uh, Operation Mantis, but that seems to be completed, mission complete. Now we're just in the uh, feed the crap out of it phase and make it huge, and then, I don't know, fight it with underground Mantis fighting ring? Yeah. <laughs>